James G here with Tarpley Music in Fort Worth, Texas. But remember, you can always find us online at tarpleymusic.com. So I'm really excited about this guitar. Here I have the PRS DGT SE. So the DGT stands for uh, David Grissom Trem. If you're not familiar with David Grissom, you've probably heard him and didn't even know it. He spent a lot of his years with uh, John Mellencamp. He's also toured with the Almond Brothers and Dixie Chicks and countless others. Uh, he's definitely a great staple of the uh, guitar world. And he basically, they designed this SE right off of his uh, PRS Gold Top 2010 uh, that he has uh, down to pretty uh, every measurement detail of the neck. So let's talk about this one in particular here. So this is a maple cap with the flate uh, veneer, um, and then we've got a mahogany back and one piece mahogany set neck. Rosewood fretboard, and this is a 10 inch radius, so very standard there. Uh, this has bird inlays. The other color you can get is the gold top, like his original gold top, and it has moon inlays. And then there is uh, 22 frets. It is a 25 inch scale length, and the scale length, of course, being from the nut here down to the uh, the saddle. And this is the PRS patented uh, molded tremolo. And this thing is great. It's held tuned very well, uh, even doing some pretty big uh, dives and stuff like that, and some push and pulls. It's held very, very well. It sounds really, really good. Uh, these are the PRS DGTS pickups. And uh, it's got a volume for your neck, and it's got a volume for the bridge, and then this is a master tone. The master tone also can be pulled up for your coil tap to get single coils here. So, and of course, your three-way toggle switch. Uh, so, extremely versatile. Once again, it's to me, it's a, hey, I need a guitar that kind of does everything. This is definitely one you should look at. Now, the neck for me, it is a little, it's a little wide for what I would normally play. Uh, of course, for bigger hands, probably fantastic. But the thing is, is I've actually been able to adjust a little bit throughout today playing it uh, to feel pretty comfortable just because the neck's made so well. Uh, and like I said before, they took calipers and they measured from, uh, you know, the nut, I think like 5, 7, 9, and 12, got all the measurements of his original uh, 2010 uh, neck feel on that. So not only is it a great looking instrument, it feels really good, great parts, right? Um, the sounds are awesome. So what I'm gonna do is I'm just gonna go through the three-way switch uh, here with clean, and then we will coil tap both of those. And then I'm gonna go through those again, going through a Strymon Riverside, just to get a good uh, overdrive sound. And then of course, we're just miking up our Fender Tone Master Deluxe Reverb here. And then we'll just kind of give you an overview of all the tones this thing has.
so we've heard a bunch of guitar tones on its own. I want to hear some of those tones with some tracks I did earlier. All right, hit it, boys. So very cool new model by uh, PRS with the DGT. So I, what what Grissom basically talked about when I watched interviews with him talking about his guitar was um, he wanted something that played like his guitar, but at a price point where more people could get it, basically. Um, and so he even does a few videos uh, where he holds up both guitars and compares them and how they look and stuff. And with the exception of kind of the color of the knobs, yeah, it's really, really hard to tell. But um, it's a really comfortable playing guitar. I think even with the wider neck that it's a little more difficult for me, I could get used to it. So, uh, but if you like a little bit more of that kind of a wide, uh, fat neck, then you should definitely pick this up. But as far as tonal qualities, it's all, it's all there. I mean, it, you can get anything that you need out of it. Um, the fact that you can actually blend the volumes of the pickups is really, really nice. Uh, there's a few times that you could, you know, if you could put something in the middle and take off a little bit of the high, you get a very jazzy tone. Um, and it's just, there's so much that I can do. It's, it's really hard to uh, put in just one video. The other thing I can't do is, of course, really explain how it feels to you, right? I can, uh, I can explain how it feels to me and give you some mechanics stuff, but you really need to come down and pick up the DGT and, and, and play it. Regardless if you've even heard of David Grissom, uh, it just, uh, it's pretty cool that he was a part of that and with his tremolo and everything, but this is an extremely uh, versatile uh, PRS that does everything that you need to do it. I don't think there's a style restraint or anything else um, with it. It's just, it's great. It's fantastic. This is a really great color. Of course, I said the other one is just a great classic um, gold top, and then you've got moon inlays. But other than that, it's, just, it's the same animal, right? So uh, I hope you got some interest in this. Um, the PRS SE guitars just in general are just knocking me out of the park every time uh, one comes out. Uh, I've yet to be disappointed in one, quite honestly. Um, this is no exception. So uh, like the video if you did enjoy it. And of course, if you haven't subscribed to our channel, you should do that because um, we're just going to continue to give out uh, as many uh, videos and demos and reviews and all kinds of things as we can. We'd love to have uh, you be a part of that. And of course, uh, if you'd like to know as new videos drop, we're dropping videos every single week. You can just turn on notifications and then we'll see you on the next one. Mm -hmm.